it's Brady. Welcome to my channel and thank you so much for joining me and welcome to another grocery haul. This is a small one. Um, somehow it was still $110, but you know, I don't, I don't even know. I don't even know what to say about that. So it is what it is. I'm going to share with you what I got and then, um, I'll try to remember prices. I know that I, I attempted to order a loaf of bread. I guess it got canceled. Um, I should say I ordered these from Target, uh, delivered via shipped, um, just to save me some time post Thanksgiving. And we do still have some produce left. Of course, we have leftovers and, you know, a fully stocked freezer and pantry. So really we didn't need much, um, but they were out of a few things. So they were out of, they didn't have any cilantro that looked good. They didn't have any, um, coleslaw mix that I ordered that looked good. And they were out of romaine lettuce. Um, so we'll make do without those. And then I thought I ordered a loaf of bread, but somehow that got canceled out of my order. And I know my shopper didn't do it. So I'm thinking either it's like the Target app when you order delivery. If something goes out of stock before you check out, it'll go ahead and take it off. Maybe that's what happened. Maybe I accidentally deleted it. Who knows? So we'll grab a loaf of bread. But we've got plenty to make do um, until... I go grocery shopping next week. So let me just share with you what I got. So I got a, a gallon of whole milk. I got two half gallons of silk almond milk. Those were $3.49 each. The whole milk, I want to say was like $4 and some change. It definitely went up. I did get a pound of hot pork uh, sausage, the Jimmy Dean brand. That was $3.99. I got some brioche hamburger buns for dinner one night this week. And I think that was $4. Those went up a lot. And then um, I got four of these 90 second jasmine rice for uh, just easy pantry thing to have. They were $1.49 each. And these are just really convenient to have on hand. And we are going to do, um, they're really convenient for lunches, but also we are going to do, um, sweet and sour chicken so I'll use probably two of these um for that night and um the then I got some honey crisp apples three pounds was $6.99 $1.29 for a box of saltine crackers the market pantry brand which is the target store brand $4.29 for the Danimals pouches I think I ordered strawberry they gave me the princess ones because that was my backup option two of the kool-aid jammers I got a grape and a blue raspberry those were, I want to say, two thirty-three each. They were there was some sort of sale, um, and then I did get some shredded iceberg lettuce. We have corn tortillas left, and we're gonna do chicken tacos. I've got lime, I've got cheese, I've got chicken, I've got my seasoning that I use for that, and the corn tortillas. So um, we just needed some lettuce and cilantro, but I guess we're gonna do without cilantro. Um, what else? Oh, eggs. Man, these were $2.99 for one dozen eggs. That's just, no, they were $3.19 for a dozen eggs. That's just hiring robbery. Um, I did want some Skittles, and I got the kids some peanut butter M&Ms. Um, I think these were $3.99 each. I did get some fruit snacks and some fruit by the foot. I wanted fruit by the foot, and I knew the girls would want some fruit snacks in their lunches, so I got those. I think these were $1.49 for the Market Pantry fruit snacks. And then these were $2.99 for the fruit by the foot. <sighs> these party size bags. Um, that's really funny because those are not party size bags uh, like I remember them. <laughs> but it is what it is. They were $5 per bag for Cheetos and Tostitos plain um, tortilla chips. Honestly, if I would have really realized what that entailed for the Cheetos, I would have skipped that. Um, yeah. Anyways, sticker shock. Oh, there is also some, there are some, uh, what is that brand? Sunmade maybe? That does the like flavored raisins. They had some of the sour watermelon raisins and my youngest loves those. So I ordered that. Now look, this was supposed to be a stocking stuffer. Look how stinking cute this is. Uh, but I, literally that's like a bite, maybe two spoonfuls of Nutella. It was a dollar, but, um, yeah, I thought that was going to be a little bit larger than that. Whatever. Uh, um, four ninety nine for the hundred and five count of Downy Infusions, the lavender and vanilla bean dryer sheets. 
I have quit using um, fabric softener and I was going to do dryer balls, but they were really expensive at Target and I have been going without any dryer sheets, anything like that for a really long time, but I needed something. The static is killing me, my towels are rough. So I did break down and buy some dryer sheets because I could not bring myself to spend $10 on some dryer balls this week. Um, so we'll see, we'll, we'll try to get some cheaper ones. Okay, um, these are also stocking stuffers, these uh, makeup brushes. So I got those, those were 25% off with whatever Black Friday deal they were doing. And then I, these were $2.29 for the makeup remover wipes, I needed those. $3 for a new dish brush. And then I did get some of the Up and Up Target brand of like OxyClean powder, and that was $5.29. That's everything. <laughs> Uh, for $110.22 plus tip. So, you know, you know, that's not the greatest. Um, in fact, that's pretty terrible to me because all I got was one pound of meat. It's a whole lot of money, but it is what it is, y'all. We did it. We got our groceries and we will make do with what we got. Probably grab a loaf of bread, maybe some cilantro and call it a week. And then I will get groceries and we will get back to normal at least until Christmas time um, for our weekly grocery haul. So this is probably my shortest one I've done in a really long time, but I thank y'all for being here. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know how you're doing, where you're shopping, how was your Thanksgiving, if you celebrate that and what you were up to. I always love getting to know y'all and chatting with y'all in the comments down below. So until our next video, y'all, that's all I've got and I will see you in the comments down below. Bye y'all.